Alright guys, seven week old Khaki Campbells. Hello ladies. Hello ladies. Hello ladies. Hello. You guys trying to chill out a little bit? When I first come in here, they're like whacked out, but they calm down after I get in here. And then the Rhode Island Reds. Yeah, hello, ladies. Yeah, hello, ladies. Hello. Hello, ladies. Got them in this grow up pen here. Hello, ladies. Whoa. Whoa, what's going on there? Got an aggressive chicken. How are you guys fighting? Hey, the Mr. Rooster. See, it's the rooster. See how he's got like a crown and that little. Gobblers down below, that's the rooster. Hey, Mr. Rooster, you two pump chump. Oh, yeah, Mr. Rooster, the two pump chump. Hello, ladies. Hello. My up and coming flock. You know, after a year and a half, you gotta get rid of the chickens because they're gonna molt. I'll get rid of them. We're gonna get up and coming gonna get an up and coming flock here you guys. Y'all Oh yeah Hello ladies Hello ladies Yeah I want the eggs man You gonna give me some eggs? Oh yeah you are They're a little skittish yeah, Kathy Campbell ducks are a little on the skittish side, y'all. Oh, yeah, you skittish. Oh, I want the eggs, man. Look how big they are. Look how big they are for seven weeks old. Yeehaw, mama. Next level, next level. Oh, yeah, you know, I'm the guy that gives you all the bread, man. Oh, I'm the guy that gives you the bread. Oh man, oh yeah, Nick Lil, Nick Lil. Hey, hey, Mr. Rooster. Oh, I see you, Mr. Rooster. Oh, I see you, Mr. Rooster. I see you, Mr. Rooster. I see you. Yeah, you're protecting the flock. You better do your job, man. Hello. Hello. Hello, little woman. Oh, man. Oh, you yeah. Nick little, Nick little, Nick little. Shitting all over the place, man. Hello, ladies. Hello, ladies. Hello, ladies. Give me the extra large eggs. Oh yeah, Mr. Rooster. I see you, Mr. Rooster. Oh man, oh yeah, neck level, neck level. Mr. Rooster's neck level, man. Oh man, oh yeah, neck level. Yeah, oh yeah, you chicken little. You little chicken littles. Hey, yeah, Mr. Rooster, see him? Get a rooster there? Oh yeah, Mr. Rooster, I see you. 
Yeah, Mr. Rooster's a two punch up, y'all. Oh, man. Oh, yeah, next level, next level. Next level, man. Oh, I got two. I think I got two roosters. That's what I had ordered, two roosters. Is the guy drinking the water over there? I think it's a rooster, too. Hey, Mrs. Chicken. You're sitting on, you're sitting on the food pot. You're gonna shit in the, shit in the food? Oh, man. You're gonna shit in the food? You can't be doing that. Mrs. Chicken. You're gonna shit in the food. Get out of there. You can't be shitting in the food. Yeah, she's gonna shit in the food, man. Oh, man. Nick Little, Nick Little. Nick Little. Hey, man. Hey, Mrs. Duckies. I'm gonna get you. Oh man, oh yeah, Nick. I'm gonna rip you, rip your heart out. Yeah, I'm gonna get you. Oh, I'm gonna get you, man. Oh yeah, I'm gonna get you. Watch out. I'm gonna rip you apart in two pieces. Oh yeah. You better watch out for me, man, because I'm a killer. Oh, yeah, Nick Little, Nick Little. I'm going to get you, man. I'm going to get you. You better run for the hills, man. Yeah, you better run for the hills. Oh, yeah. I'm going to put you in the pot, man. You guys are gonna be chicken. You guys are gonna be duck soup. Yeah, you guys are gonna be duck soup. Yeah, you're gonna be duck soup. You guys are gonna be duck soup. Oh yeah, Nick Little, Nick Little. Chicken little, chicken little, chicken little. All right, guys. I want to do a little, do a little update. What I did back here is um, I cut a bunch of trees down over here, and there was a bunch of um, wood and stuff that I pulled up, pulled chains on there, and pulled all that stuff out. You know, fallen trees that was down there. That's the paper street behind my property. So I did come in here with the um, the little excavator, and I, I scratched all the dirt and pull all the prickers out and whatnot and there was a bunch of stuff that was that was here that I cut down and but there was a lot there was a good sized tree that was all dead that I cut down. Just a little little ramp here. There was probably a you know cord, cord and a half of wood that I put on Craigslist for free and a guy came and cut it all up and got rid of it. Today, but I kind of cleared this whole area out. Um, cut everything back because I was getting a lot of overgrowth. When it really rains a lot in, in the rainy season, this kind of like gets gets flowing here, and then in the summertime it will dry out. So, um, 
probably gonna put a coop back here, a uh, chicken coop and a duck coop back here, and I might put a I might put a gate here and let them out into the water area uh, in the wet season. We'll see. I did do a lot of work back here. It's been a couple of days, a couple of days of work, and I got all that that brush to burn and stuff in the barrels. But I just didn't do no videos of it because um, just been I don't know a lot of work. Probably should have did a video, but yeah. So I cleaned it up, cut all these these dead trees down, and cleaned up all these prickle bushes and stuff that was over overhanging my property. I gotta keep this. I gotta keep this clear, cause this will, you know, if we get like hurricane or something, it, this will this will flow and it goes all the way along my neighbor's property and under the street. So I have to. I have to actually keep this clear. It's my my duty as a good citizen to keep this um, flowing, and it will flow. You know, hurricane season. Or, right now it's wet season, but. In the summertime, this will all dry out. This will be all dry. Come summertime, be nothing here. I got a bunch of stuff to pick up, and I got a bunch of stuff to burn. I burnt a bunch of stuff the other day. Uh, my burning barrels. Got a little, little pool for the ducks. I gotta burn all this this stuff here. I'm letting it dry out. I got some roots over there. I'm gonna let them dry out. But the old burning barrels. Steve is working again, y'all. Nick level, Nick level. I put this fence up here. I did put a bunch of wood chips down. But that's the deal. That's the deal. Steve is working again, y'all. I'm gonna kind of let this this land all dry out, and I'll scratch it some more, and Let's see all the stuff that. I've been busy doing this stuff. I probably should have did some videos on it, but whatever. It is what it is. I got my little compost there. I turn this thing every day. The thing's full. Full of chicken shit. I turn it every day. I'm going to get another one. I know what I can get another one of these things. And it's full. Two weeks. That should be good for compost. So they say two weeks. I turn on it every day for I don't know three, four days or whatever. Next level, mama. Steve Lev is a real working man, yo. See all the stuff I, all the burnt stuff I threw in here, all the ashes. I'm gonna turn all this over the rototiller. Don't really smell. As long as you turn it over. I got 
I got the coops to clean out too, so we'll see. Do what I can, man. I do what I can. <laughs> Look at the antennas go. Look at the antennas. <laughs> Look at them. Oh man. Give it the old vibration treatment. <laughs> Holy shit. He attacked me. <laughs>